Hi there, uh, Cancer. Here's a general look at your solar chart for April 2009. Well, um, yeah, the good news is I think you'll feel as though you're really starting to move forwards now and you can really get your teeth into something. You can really get the cogs in the wheels to start turning each other in sync. <laughs> um, and as long as you're on the ball mentally, because maybe, you know, there'll be more paperwork for, for you around now or maybe more correspondence, um, paper chasing, that kind of thing, um, you can uh, get things done in a more proactive, uh, dynamic, sort of decisive kind of way. This is definitely not the month to be backwards in coming forwards, Cancer. It is the moment for you to reach is to reach higher, is to reach wider, is to think outside of the box and is to grasp what it is you need for your progress. And make it clear, make it clear to yourself and make it clear to others what your intentions are. What You know, it, it'll be a time for you to prove things. You might feel, you know, this is it. You know, I've really, I've really got to follow through here. And I think you will. And um, you could, uh, uh, you know, set a standard for yourself, make sure it's not too high a standard, but it's definitely, you know, a next step up, that sort of a, a standard. And then you will be able to achieve it because the mistake we all make is that you know we wait so long for something and then we overreach ourselves so just do these steps if you possibly can and you know follow through be consistent be persevering be patient as well and uh, you should be successful with anything that you are getting into at the moment so if it's you know work related then um, put your best foot forward there. Um, it'll be about, a little bit about presentation and image for you then. Uh, but also uh, chasing up people who are outside your normal sphere. You know, maybe they're at a distance. Maybe they're in a foreign land. Maybe they have an expertise. Maybe that's a teacher or a mentor you're looking for. Maybe you don't know you're looking for them. Maybe they just drop into your life out of nowhere. That's altogether likely for you at the moment. It's going to help you move forward. You've got this impetus now. You've got this sort of general kind of dynamic rolling forwards now and it's likely that important people in your life you know the, uh, what you're seeking the person you're seeking then who has the knowledge um, could be authority figures could be somebody who has information it could be somebody bureaucratic I guess it could be somebody legal even um, guardians teachers mentors people even gurus um, people somebody in somebody who's important to you somebody who has you know a maturity or a power or an ability that you want a piece of um those sorts of people are very likely to lean in your direction to be very favorably disposed towards you in april cancer um particularly from the beginning of the month until the 12th and then from the 24th of the month until the end of the month those are the times there so contact with those so you know if you if you if you're in employment you're learning whilst you're doing you, you're listening very well you, or if you're in a business thing again it's step by step but you're learning and you're listening if you're if you're into something academic if you're into training or study once again um this is a good time now for you to be feel this momentum pushing you forwards but at the same time listen well ask the right questions and um, you know you'll be you'll be attracting success into your life uh, for now or for something that's in the future now when Mars moves on the 23rd that's when you're going to get even more sort of more driven you know more steamed up about you know your direction in life uh, but also then uh, it, the energies will have shifted in, and it, it won't be it, it, it will be more important the contacts you make and how well you you integrate in with maybe a group of like-minded people maybe people who are gathered together to for, for, for you know similar reasons and um, once again this this you know uh, tr 
trying out new things, exposing yourself to unfamiliar um, scenarios or maybe something that you haven't done for a very long time. Uh, and uh, yeah, and, and that is definitely the way for you to be going. And also, you know, the energy would of with it, that kind of feel to it will just be coming towards you so if you've launched something if you've launched a project or an enterprise um or if in fact you've launched yourself <laughs> into something new um you know you, you're breaking new ground really up until the 23rd especially um that's going to you know the energy of mars there is really going to help you to um explore an adventure but also uh expand uh, in a uh, you know and have success come into your life particularly with those as i say those people who are at a distance or connections with foreign lands uh, and remember as well don't think too small <laughs> don't undersell yourself or think too narrowly about what you're capable of but of course be sensible um you know uh, we're here in this rather limiting material world so you've got to um you know always always have a contingency plan <laughs> now things could feel a little mentally taxing on the fifth um but you know you just have to work a little bit harder there um to get the facts straight maybe or you know whatever it is that you, you have to know for the benefit of somebody else perhaps but ultimately of course it's for your own benefit also unusual material or something unexpected could um come along and open your mind to a new way of thinking that's on the 15th it could be you know um a visit uh, or a, you know a contact with somebody from uh, at a distance to you um and uh, or academic work you know educational stuff and on the 11th well that's a really positive aspect there for you cancer which could push things forward in a very nice way uh give you the green light there give you some success uh, make you feel you know good about yourself um and just brighten your day really and we all need that now early cancerians where well, you've got pluto around um that will be the first four to five days of cancer that's bringing up old stuff that's that's making you feel more sensitive more likely to overreact to other people because for you, some for, for them, something's very small. For you, it could be really big in your mind. And they know how to push your buttons. It's a karmic influence. Pluto is a karmic planet. That's what you both came here for. Um, do your best with it. Bear in mind, we're all learning in this big schoolroom we call Earth. And you can only do your best in any given moment. But also, ultimately, after the Pluto uh, transits are gone over for you, you will have revalued yourself, your relationships, um, your identity. You know, you may turn out to be somebody very different to who you thought you were um, when you come out the other side in, in a, around about 18 months to two years from now. And no good to hang on to the past. Uh, it won't help because what lies in front of you is regeneration, rebirth. Um, a new you so accept what it, it really and truly is to make you really and truly happy cancer well that's it for april um, if you know your rising sign have a listen to that too